Gladys West wasn't done learning when she decided to go to Virginia Tech to earn her Ph.D. at 70 years old. I had so much that I hadn't done. You know, I, I feel like I have a good brain. I need to use it. And I, I keep studying. Growing up on a small farm in rural Virginia in the 1930s, Gladys learned it wasn't about being poor. We never thought that we were poor, stuck in the mud poor. We always thought that uh, we see crops growing, things, things getting bigger and better. At the time, options for girls at her school included becoming a teacher or seamstress, but Gladys stood out for her talent in mathematics. They were trying to encourage me to do something a little different from what the other students are doing, some of the other students are doing, uh, because they felt that I had talent to, to do it and, and make it. Gladys was class valedictorian and earned the first full scholarship to what was then Virginia State College, where she earned a bachelor's in math in 1952 and a master's two years later. The U.S. Naval Proving Ground hired Gladys in 1956. She was only one of four black employees and two women. I'm going to a place where they're going to be bringing in humongous computers and you have a lot of space to process the data. It's here Gladys won praise for solving complex mathematical equations by hand. She then became part of the team programming computers to do the work and went on to develop a groundbreaking program capable of calculating satellite orbits. It's that work that laid the foundation for the global positioning system, or GPS, we rely on today. It's just amazing. It's just amazing what were they capability has brought. Her pioneering work in aerospace and defense industries went largely unnoticed, but in 2018, the U.S. Air Force inducted this hidden figure into its Space and Missiles Pioneer Hall of Fame. Reflecting on her 93 years, Gladys realizes she had many mentors, starting with her own mother, who pushed her to embrace her talent and dreams. I think it's really exciting when you go into something that you really love and you're really doing it and you see it working and you see it go, spreads out into the world.